This is your Joker. This is drugs. He's also Bane. This is your Joker on drugs. Any questions? Yeah, I have a question. Why are you so serious, Batman? Kids, don't do drugs. Love you, kids. It's time for your what up big kids, here's your big review, the Batman Arkham Asylum Deluxe Titan Joker by DC Collectibles. So here we got Joker as he looked as the final boss in Batman Arkham Asylum, Titan Joker, as he injected himself with the Titan Venom. Uh, looks super menacing, which I really love. Look at that smile, those teeth. And he has the green eyes, and his skin is like pasty white, but has some nice paint detail. DC Collectibles has done a great job with really bringing out the detail and you have parts of his muscles showing and his bones coming out of his ribs that look like claws. The detail is insane on this thing. And I love the green veins coming out. Big old spots right here. Look just sick. Literally, he looks sick. And we know how sickly he becomes after in Batman Arkham City. Love the freaking bones protruding out. I love, by the way, don't you love his punk rock hair? I love how he somehow ended up with a mohawk after the game. But yeah, look at that bone and stuff. It's just like super sick. Love it. It's so gruesome. It's like he just bone protruding out his spine. So sick. The detail I just love. And look, I love this like, his like, uh, jacket that's ripped off, you know, has the very Hulk, you know, torn clothing going on. And the bones protruding out of his um, elbow is just amazing. Just like that detail. And look at those fingernails. Holy crap. Joker, you need to cut them nails. Holy crap. And look at that detail on the hand. Just so awesome. I just absolutely love it. So cool. Those nails. And then he has this perfectly trunks like the Hulk. Of course, you know, you can't show your hoo-ha, you know. You don't want to see the Joker's hoo-ha, Joker butt. You know, I love that and it's sculpted there. It's not just painted. And he's got bone between on his knee. So sick. You know, the detail all over, the dripping blood. No peg holes in this one. He's a SSDC DC Comics. Look at the Joker toes. I'm surprised his toes didn't get all long too, but it's cool. For Shardimus Prime, you love them Joker toes, Shardimus? Oh yeah. Yeah, and then, um, yeah, you could love them too, Shardimus. Yeah, but overall the detail is just sick. Articulation, it's pretty good on this figure for being a big DC collectibles figure. You know, his head can fully rotate like this way which is and it goes up and down a little side to side so good pretty good head articulation go up and down pretty good the arms fully rotate and you just want to be very careful with them of course because of the material it's made they go in and out that much not too much they do rotate at the bicep which is great they do uh, bend at the elbow which you have to be very careful with you know you don't want to do it there we go bend at the elbow and it rotates at the wrist. So, you know, normal uh, DC uh, um, collectibles articulation, but it also um, has waist articulation, which is great, full waist articulation. Now the legs, I do like, they go forward and back and in and out a little bit and rotates at the upper part of the leg right here and bends at the knee, but the only bad thing is because of how heavy he is, you can't really put him in any real like, you gotta kind of uh, balance him. You can put him in like that kind of pose, but if you really put it where his arms are like facing out, he'll be kind of top heavy and like one of there. But for the most part, I mean, you gotta have him where his legs aren't out that much because if they are out more, I mean, uh, it stands pretty good. Like I said, you just have to be very careful because he can't topple over. Showtime! Man. Showtime, Joker. You're not even ready for this fight. You are half naked. You need to cut your nails. What are you, a clown punk? Nah, Batsy. I think I'm more like the Hulk. And just like the Hulk, this is gonna be a size comparison time. So here you can see the Deluxe Titan Joker is huge. If you count his hair and stuff, he is about 12 inches tall. He's a really big figure. You can see how much he is compared to the DC Direct 
Arkham uh, Asylum Joker and the 6-inch Mattel Arkham City Batman as well as the Arkham Asylum Play Arts Kai Joker. If you're a big fan of Batman Arkham Asylum and love, uh, played the game till the end, you will absolutely love uh, this Titan Joker. The only thing you have to watch out for is I heard some people reporting the legs coming off and like I said you have to be very careful when balancing him because the big old arms so like I said if you have both arms out he's more likely to fall but the detail is amazing. The articulation is good you know the pretty good what you can expect from a DC collectibles figure and it doesn't come with anything else no stand or anything but still for the size and detail uh, this is such an awesome figure. It retails for about 60, 65 bucks. You can get it in like, you know, usually at places like, um, like I know um, Alter Ego Comics had it, if not like usually local comic shops or BPTS or even Amazon you can get. So like I said, for the size and detail and if, uh, if you're just a fan of the Joker, even the, the monstrous Joker, I definitely say get in because it is such an awesome figure. For more geek news, reviews, and more, check out BKBN.net. I'm Sean Long, member of Subway Trinum, in a big way. Where does he get those wonderful toys? He gets them at Alter Ego Comics. Com. Excuse me, he was saying he gets them at AlterEgoComics.com. <laughs> For the latest and hot toys, sideshow collectibles, replicas, and more, visit AlterEgoComics.com. They take PayPal, pre ordered and they lowest prices on the net. Lowest price for hot toys. You must be joking. Do I look like I'm joking? Go to BKBN.net! Go to BKBN.net! Go to BKBN.net! I tell you to go! Go down! Hey, Batman! Hey, Batman! Hey, Batsy! You know what's my favorite movie? Clash of the Titan! Joker! Oh, that movie sucked. Well, at least it's better than Batman and Robin.